This is what the early morning fit life looks like. So glamorous. I don't even know if my eyes are open right now. Interested or I'm not listening or I'm indifferent Truly I ain't got no business here But since my friends are here I just came to kick it But really I would rather be at home all by myself Not in this room with people who don't even care about my well-being I don't dance, don't ask, I don't need a boyfriend So you can't go back, please enjoy your party, I'll be here First session of the day done. I done 20 minutes of cardio. I did it fasted. Now I'm going to have some breakfast. So I like to start my morning with um, a lemon and apple cider vinegar warm. So what I usually do is put the kettle on, um, make it, go have a shower. By the time I get out of the shower, it's time for me to drink it. We don't have any lemon, so I'm gonna have a lemon and ginger tea. And I'm just going to short some of this apple cider vinegar. Something I've been really struggling with is keeping up my water intake. So I just finished a whole cup of water um, after having that apple cider vinegar. I'm going to have another cup now before I make my tea and then have a shower. So I know I'm already up for the day. But I'm gonna make sure I fill up my big two liter bottle um, from the Big Bottle Co. I'll link them below and then I shouldn't have a problem. No excuses. Just done my makeup, haven't done my hair yet and I'm just sipping on my tea. It's pretty cold now, but that's okay. Get it done. Putting my lunches for the day. So I have cauliflower rice and some turkey in here. And then I've got some turkey breast, which I'm going to be putting some basmati rice into. Now I'm really rushed for breakfast, so I'm going to make breakfast in a takeaway container and eat it in the car.
Hold, 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 hold the phone. The Lonely Stoner, Mr. Solo Dolo. So just picked up some things from Woolies. Um, I've just got some mushrooms, chicken breast. Got these veggies because they looked really good. They just, I don't know, shouted my name. Steak and steamed cauliflower, which I am obsessed with, but I cook it on the pan and it's amazing. And I usually put some like Moroccan seasoning on it, but I forgot taco seasoning today, so I'll be using that. So I just covered my chicken in this here. I'm all fresh. I've just had a shower. Looking like a grub because that's just my life. Um, I thought I'd share with you what vitamins I'm taking at the moment. So I'm having a multivitamin. This is just one from um, my local grocery store. So you can get it from Woolworths or Clothes. Coles. Synovus is a pretty um, like known brand. You can probably get it in most chemists as well. So I've been taking two of those. I've just got the Blackmores Fish Oil Odorless in the mini capsules, so the same strength as the normal ones, but they're mini, which is good for me because I struggle to swallow tablets. Um, so I've been having two of those as well. I have two of these Spirulina, if that's how you say it, tablets in the morning because um, they do give you energy, so I wouldn't recommend having them before bed. But it's just a good alternative to drinking chlorophyll because that tastes disgusting, um, or if you don't like the texture of powdered greens. Now I have also been taking this magnesium powder. I just find magnesium tablets are too big for me to swallow. Um, and I was recommended by a guy at the chemist to have a scoop of this before bed and it will knock you out and you'll have the best sleep ever and it honestly works. So get onto this. It's the Blooms brand. If you're from um, where I'm from, you can get it from Blooms Chemist in Green Hills. So I'm just going to sit here and just speak to you guys, but I don't really know what to say. Yep. Or how to say it. The reason I started this channel was to document my prep. And if you've been following my videos, you'll see that I haven't stepped on stage yet, which is fine. Um, anyone who's done a comp prep or tried to do a comp prep understands that it you can't always just work it perfectly. Um, so I am starting to prep again. Um about 15 weeks into my first show I'll be doing ICN um, in Winuna will be my first show so I'm really excited about that I'll have a bikini soon so I can practice properly I just want to be able to document more about how I'm feeling um, so I can look back on this and see you know what I went through and where I come out on the other side and you know be here so people can see what it's like or people who are gonna prep um, so they can see, you know, what they're in for. Same, what I experience won't be the same as what my friends who prep experience, and it won't be the same as what you may experience. So as for the week just gone, I've had a pretty good week. I had a really intense training session yesterday, and I got really emotional after my training session, which I talked to a few friends, and they said that that's normal. Um, it can, it just happens. It was the weirdest feeling, like nothing was wrong. I just felt really sad after my session, and I just like, got in the car and cried so if my <laughs> oh, coach is watching this I don't know I'm just like it wasn't a personal thing I was just feeling really emotional um diet's been going really well I'm having a cheat day a week um so I smash that out on sun or cheat meal sorry smash out that cheat meal on Sunday so I just want to be really raw and honest from now on and I'm going to um, make a more of a conscious effort to document how I'm feeling. Um, I'll try and do a vlog each week 
and I'll kind of try and recap on the week and um, see how I was feeling. I've also met like so many amazing friends in this last week and they know who they are and I can't thank them enough. Um, it's honestly like a brush, 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 breath of fresh air to meet like so many like-minded girls. It's um, and just to have such a supportive boyfriend to help me with, you know, I have a crazy life. But there's worse. There's people worse off. I'm not ungrateful for my life, but I have a lot going on all the time, and he's just very supportive all the time. And I couldn't, I couldn't ask for anything more than that. 